As demand for electric vehicles continues to surge, global supply shortages have become a significant concern. Compounding this issue is the environmental impact of lithium extraction, a key component in EV batteries. A promising alternative on the horizon is the iron air battery. Tesla, known for its relentless pursuit of innovation, has been exploring advancements in battery technology. But what sets the iron air battery apart? Is it capable of surpassing the performance of the lithium-based batteries currently powering Tesla's EV models? And what might this mean for the future of energy storage? In today's Tesla Global video, we'll explore these questions and more. The introduction of the iron air battery represents a major breakthrough in energy storage technology. Companies like Form Energy are pushing the boundaries by utilizing readily available materials like iron and air to create this innovative solution. Form Energy's iron air battery system is set to disrupt existing technologies with its remarkable potential. Supported by a $390 million investment from the U.S. Department of Energy through the Power Up New England initiative, this system delivers a power output of 85 megawatts and an impressive storage capacity of 8.5 gigawatt hours, making it the largest battery system ever designed. The Iron Air battery offers up to 100 hours of energy storage, a dramatic improvement over current options. In contrast to traditional lithium-ion batteries, which typically provide around 4 hours of storage, the Iron Air battery can sustain energy for approximately four days. This makes it an essential technology for bridging energy gaps, such as during periods of low solar power generation due to cloudy weather. The battery operates on a unique principle known as reversible rusting. This process involves applying an electric current to convert rust into iron and back again. Typically, a battery consists of a positively charged electrode, cathode, and a negatively charged electrode, anode, both immersed in a liquid called an electrolyte. When the battery discharges, chemical reactions cause the anode to release electrons. These electrons leave the battery through a conductor to power a device and eventually return to the battery via the cathode. The electrolyte facilitates this process by allowing ions to move between the anode and cathode. If you are enjoying the video, please subscribe to Tesla Global. Inform Energy's iron air battery one side of the battery is equipped with a thin, negative electrode, while the other side features a positive electrode made of iron powder held together by a mesh, with a water-based electrolyte sandwiched in between. Air passes through the negative electrode and reacts with the electrolyte, creating negatively charged hydroxide ions on the inner surface of the electrode. According to Zach Judkins, Form Energy's Vice President of Engineering, the battery starts with the positive electrode in a completely metallic state, made of iron. After 100 hours, the iron is fully rusted and the battery is depleted. To recharge or clean the battery, an electric current is sent back through the system, reversing the chemical reactions. To discharge, they supply oxygen and release electrons, explains Judkins. To charge the battery, they supply electrons and release oxygen. This process breaks the rust back down into its components, oxygen and iron. About the size of a side-by-side -side washer and dryer, each module contains around 501 meter tall battery cells with each individual cell housing the iron and air electrodes necessary for electrochemical reactions that store and discharge electricity. These cells are filled with a non-flammable water-based electrolyte similar to what's found in AA batteries. The modules can be grouped together allowing for the creation of modular, scalable, megawatt-scale power blocks. The rise of iron air batteries signals a potentially revolutionary shift in energy storage, offering distinct advantages over traditional lithium-ion technology, especially in terms of cost and scalability. According to Form Energy, these batteries can be manufactured at roughly one-tenth the cost of lithium-ion batteries. For context, the cost of lithium-ion batteries currently ranges from $130 to $200 per kilowatt hour. In 2023, the cost of lithium-ion batteries was $139 per kilowatt hour, 
so iron air batteries are projected to cost as little as $20 per kilowatt hour. In addition to the lower cost, the materials used in iron air batteries, iron, water, and air, are both abundant and inexpensive. This stands in stark contrast to lithium ion batteries, which rely on materials like lithium, cobalt, and nickel. According to figures from Benchmark Mineral Intelligence, the price of the lithium rich raw material spodumene rose 478.3% between January 2021 and January 2022, primarily due to growing demand and supply chain constraints. Do not forget to smash the like button. Iron Air batteries are not just cost effective, but also offer superior safety features. Lithium ion batteries are prone to thermal runaway, a condition where the battery heats up uncontrollably leading to potential fires or explosions. This is particularly concerning in electric vehicles and large-scale energy storage systems. In contrast, iron-air batteries do not have this risk, thanks to their unique chemistry, which doesn't involve volatile materials. As a result, they can be operated more safely and require less complex and expensive safety measures. This makes them particularly well-suited to balance out the intermittent nature of renewable energy sources like wind and solar, where energy production doesn't always align with demand. The recyclability of iron air batteries also adds to their appeal. Lithium ion batteries, although widely used, pose significant recycling challenges due to the toxic and rare metals they contain. The recycling process for lithium ion batteries is complex and costly, with only about 5% of these batteries currently being recycled globally. Iron air batteries, on the other hand, do not contain heavy metals, making them easier and cheaper to recycle. Now we turn to you. Which type of battery do you prefer? Comment 1 if you favor the new iron air battery for its long duration storage and cost benefits. Comment 2 if you prefer lithium ion batteries for their high efficiency and established performance. Share your thoughts in the comments below. Despite the promising advancements of iron air batteries, they come with significant challenges when compared to lithium ion technology. One major issue is their lower energy efficiency. Iron air batteries exhibit a round trip efficiency of approximately 50 to 60%, significantly less than the 90% plus efficiency found in lithium ion batteries. This inefficiency means a considerable amount of energy is lost during charge and discharge cycles. Another critical challenge is the size and weight of iron air batteries. With a maximum instantaneous power output of just 85 megawatts, iron air batteries fall short compared to other large-scale energy systems that can deliver 800 to 1000 megawatts. Additionally, the management of the air supply, which is vital for the battery's performance, adds complexity and maintenance requirements. The technology is still in its early stages of development and unforeseen technical and scalability challenges may arise as it progresses. However, there is good news. Iron air batteries can be optimized effectively when combined with lithium ion batteries and renewable energy sources, resulting in a highly efficient energy system configuration. Iron air batteries offer high energy storage capacity with up to 1,000 to 1,500 watt-hours per kilogram and a lower production cost due to the abundance and affordability of raw materials. Despite their higher production costs and shorter lifespan of 500 to 1,500 cycles, lithium-ion batteries are ideal for short-term energy needs. By integrating these two types of batteries, one can leverage the long-term storage capabilities of iron-air batteries and the high performance of lithium-ion batteries. This combination allows for cost-effective and efficient energy management, ensuring a stable energy supply by storing excess renewable energy during high production periods and providing immediate energy when required. With these advancements, how will Tesla's battery technology adapt? As iron-air batteries gain momentum, Tesla must continue innovating to maintain its competitive edge. Tesla's existing battery technologies, including lithium-ion and LFP options, have set industry standards. What are your thoughts on the trade-offs between iron-air and lithium-ion batteries? Could this emerging technology 
represent the future of energy storage, or are there significant challenges that need to be addressed? We invite you to share your insights in the comments below. If you found this video informative and wish to stay updated on the latest developments in technology and innovation, please like and subscribe to our channel. Thank you.